Hey, what's up, guys? Um, Jose here. Um, today I'm gonna be unboxing uh, a couple products from Angelus, like the Angelus brand. Uh, basically, what this brand is, it's basically for sneaker customizers. Uh, it's things like paint, tape, paint brushes, stuff like that. Um, it even has laces and uh, starter kits for like cleaning your shoes, starter kits for painting as well. Um, but today I bought a couple um, products from them, so I'm going to be unboxing them. Uh, right here we have this red um, vinyl tape. This right here is going to be my best friend because say if I wanted to tape around um, the line on like a van shoe, on, on like one of the van shoes, then I'll be able to paint that without messing up the, for instance, like the black around it or something like that. So best friend right here. Next we have this right here. It's a cleaner, basically this is the starter kit for the cleaner. Um, we have the brush and we have the easy cleaner itself. The easy cleaner cleans stuff like canvas, so canvas basically means like Converse's or um, Vans, or it cleans stuff like leather, so like Air Force's, uh, stuff like that. So it's really good. I used it on one of my Vans and it worked really good. They were really dirty, so. Definitely, if you want to buy something to clean your shoes, definitely buy this. Also, just to know something, this brush is good, but I also use cotton swabs and those little flat things. They're also cotton swabs, but like they're flat and has a hole in it. Next, we have this X-Acto knife. This right here comes with um, five extra detail blades and comes with the, the, the X-Acto knife itself. This right here um, helps me Cut, or cut specific shapes of the um, tape if I wanted to, or say if I wanted to really, um, take out the swoosh on like an Air Force One, then this will help me with that task. I'll probably make a video doing that in the future, so make sure you check that out. Then we have the um, paint brushes. These paint brushes come with five paint brushes. They go from basically this big square to this little small one right here. So this right here, you can do really small, fine print things. And this right here, you can cover a vast area, like a really good area. So definitely be sure to pick up these paint brushes because they're really, really good. Next, we have the paint itself. Um, in my package, I got three paints. Basically, I got, oh, basically I got flat white. I got flat white and then I got flat black. You may be asking why it's called flat black or flat white is because if you just get black or white, it tends to be more glossier than the flat and flat black, the flat white and flat black. And the only reason why I got it for me is because I'm gonna be painting on like canvas more, so like vans and converses and stuff. And this also works on leather, but it just tends to give it a more matte look than a glossier look. And then just got a standard, we just got a standard red. We got uh, the fire red, which is, I haven't used it yet, but as you can see, it looks like a nice red. <laughs> then we have this. This is a professional leather prepare and glazer. This is basically like, you put this on, if you're gonna customize a shoe, like a leather shoe, you put this on right before, because anything else, if you don't put this on, then you're literally, your paint is gonna scrub off, or say if you kick, like, you hit like the bottom, like when you're going down the stairs, or you like, and you hit your shoe on the back of the stair, or like you hit like a curb with your stair, it's gonna take the paint. Um, it's gonna take the paint right off. But with this, this tends to keep the paint permanently on your shoe. So do this, and what also works as a, um, if you don't have this, what also works is acetone. So two, two of those things, but since I have this, I'm obviously gonna use this. Then we have the matte acrylic finisher. This basically is used when you are done painting your shoe and this is, this is a clear product. So you paint it on your shoe. Um, you paint it on your shoe after you uh, are done painting your shoe with the colors. This will basically give it a matte look and not a glossier look and which will help if you got regular paint and not like the flat black or flat white type color. So this will definitely help it giving it that matte look of like a canvas shoe or something like that. Then we got t these two little things. Um, this is called Duller. 
This is basically for a gloss reducer as well. You may be asking me why I got a lot of gloss reducing stuff. I am already said it, but I'm gonna be painting on canvas more. I don't want, I don't want my paint to have that glossy look. So that's why I got this, and that's why I got a small one, because I got a lot of stuff to do with that. But yeah, definitely Dolor is definitely something you may need. So if you wanna paint stuff that has a matte look, so get Dolor. And then I got two soft. You're gonna put this in. It's called a, it's a fabric medium. This right here, you have to mix it in with your paint. Otherwise, your paint will be really weird. I haven't really got to experience that yet. So later on in a later video, I would tell you guys what's like wrong with it. But make sure you put this in. Get too soft always. And also, I think if you air if you air uh, spray, get this as well. Then we got one of the biggest things. This right here is um. Is a it's a necessity because this will speed up your painting process and speed up basically your whole customizing in a general. Right here, this is the biggest boy in this whole box. This is also the most expensive, which that says a lot because this is only twenty something dollars. So yeah, this right here is a heating gun. You basically need this to speed up your um your uh your drying time, basically, because if you just let it air dry your paint is going to take hours your whole process is going to take hours so definitely do this and also there tends to be a thing you're which in a future video you'll you'll um see but if i'm painting you have to do multiple coats and this will help you dry your first coat your second coat your third coat for you to do more coats faster so this is definitely a necessity if you want to start get this as well and then we have this one this right here this is water and uh, stain repellent. This is easy light spray you do when your shoe is done so that it resists water and stains. And I use this on my previous vans, uh, my flame vans. These, this, I mean, this works really, really well. So definitely use this if you're gonna buy things. Definitely use this. Right? And then for me buying all those things, uh, I got a couple free things. First, I got this sticker. This sticker right here. This sticker is really nice. It has uh, mint raspberry and turquoise acrylic paint on it. And it's like fishes. Definitely a good, a good thing. That was free. Then I got this uh, Angelus uh, red um, car scent. My brain just like destroyed itself. Got this car scent right here. And then. I got this red lanyard for all free. Those three things were free. So yeah, guys, um, this video has been uh, a long time in making only because I've kind of been procrastinating and uh, I just didn't know how to make it. But as you can see, I don't have the best setup. So just bear with me while we grow because I'm kind of cooked right now. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, definitely stay tuned for my future videos because that's when I'm gonna be making a customized shoe video very soon. And I hope you guys like that because I'm gonna work hard on it. But uh, hope you guys hope you guys enjoyed my video. Make sure you like, sub subscribe, and uh, comment if you want to. Also share, and uh, see you in the next one.